Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. That's cool. Thank you. Is that like pinned on? Yeah, it was like a, I didn't want to wear a bow tie. No, it's you know? su it's such a cool alternative to a bow tie. I Thank love that. You. you know, taking a page out of your out of your book where you know, do the thing you want to do. Thing. Go go all out. Yeah. yeah. Tell me about this, I mean, leather dress. I mean, gorgeous. It's amazing. Thank you. It's Bell Men. It's uh Lorraine Schwartz diamonds. I'm feeling very special tonight. I would say so. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? 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 I didn't know diamonds came that big. Oh my god. Insane. Insane. But you know, everything about Barbie, the accessories were always oversized, so we've been really enjoying playing with that. I bet. This is one I feel like it comes with an armed guard yeah, or something. I've probably got like, yeah, trained. I've got like little red beams on me right now. <laughs> that or on me. <laughs> you never know, right? Good lord. Hold Where on to that hiding? thing. Where are they hiding? Um, tell me, I feel like the, the, this has been the most incredible ride. Right, Barbie, that working on this yeah. film from the, all of the secrets, like leading up to the actual release of the movie, to like now being able to celebrate the work and every everything that went into it. But when you wake up on mornings like this, like it's got to feel like, damn, we're we did it. It does, and you got to remember to really like take it in in the moment because it goes so fast, and then before you know it, you're like back working on the next thing, and you forget that you had a real moment to celebrate something, and it's so rare. It's just a miracle that a movie even gets made, and to have it be appreciated too is just, you gotta, yeah, you gotta stop and smell the roses. Literally. Literally. <laughs> uh, um, I'm gonna say, I feel like that, that scene, America Ferreira's monologue yeah. in particular, was one of those moments, many in this film, but one of those moments where people stood up yeah. in the movie theater. Women were like, yes! They did. People, the reactions, watching people's reactions to Gloria's monologue, the speech that America does, has been one of the funnest parts. It was from the very first cut of the movie, that's what made people really stand up and vocalize their appreciation. It was it was like everyone was like, oh, she's finally articulating the thing we've always thought, and she's saying it for us, and it's amazing. In a way that we've always thought. Yeah. yeah. Okay, we, speaking of, we've been asking some of the powerful women tonight, just so we're on the last line of the monologue, we're cutting it together. Would you do us the honors of, of delivering the Which last one? line? This here, right here. And if all of that is, oh yes, all of, okay. And if all of that is true for a doll just representing a woman, then I don't even know. I can't do it as well as America, though. No, but listen. I, mean, I listen, we, I tried. We, you, did, you didn't even have to. It was amazing. I did not know that you fell asleep to Harry Potter. I didn't know that Harry Potter was so soothing to you. The world. Have I said that publicly? <laughs> How embarrassing. Have I told you? How embarrassing. Um, yes, I do. I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. Huge. Uh, Obsessively. We're gonna, we're gonna see him tomorrow. Would what? you? What do you mean? Daniel Radcliffe. <laughs> We're gonna see him. Why? How? Because you know we're uh, the. Yeah, just I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna kick it with him a little bit. I will.